Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Star Wars Coffee, where in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at a leaked description for the Ahsoka Disney Plus series. That's today here on Star Wars Coffee. Greetings, Exalted Ones. Welcome to Star Wars Coffee, the only place on the internet that you need to stay up to date with all things Star Wars. We're talking the latest Star Wars news, leaks, and of course, as always, giving you my analysis. Channel memberships are now live, and for $1.99 a month, you can get exclusive videos from me weekly as we rewatch the entire Star Wars series together. Back in Disney Investors Day 2020, Disney announced a plethora of new Star Wars projects, including the Obi-Wan Kenobi series officially announced, casting Hayden Christensen returning as Darth Vader, as well as Rangers of the New Republic, a Lando Calrissian series, the Cassian series, as well as a High Republic series, the Acolyte, and Ahsoka, among others. The Ahsoka series, the only description we were given at the time of Disney Investors Day 2020 was after making her long-awaited live-action debut in The Mandalorian, Ahsoka Tano's story, written by Dave Filoni, will continue in a limited series starring Rosario Dawson and executive produced by Dave Filoni and Jon Favreau. What this limited series starring Rosario Dawson means is that this will literally be like the Kenobi series, where it, where it will be just one season and it will fill in the gaps of what was going on with Ahsoka's storyline. So it's going to intersect with what she was doing in The Mandalorian, which we learned in her episode of The Mandalorian, which we can kind of consider a pilot for the Ahsoka show. That was the only episode directed by Dave Filoni of that season, and what Ahsoka's mission during that episode was before it being intercepted by Mando was to get the information she needed from the Magistrate about Grand Admiral Thrawn's location. So what this continues to tell us is that this is going to be the spin-off of the Star Wars Rebels show. So that was an animated show that if you haven't seen, I recommend going to watch, especially if you're interested in the Ahsoka Tano series, as this will give you what Ahsoka was doing post-Clone Wars, and pretty much the cliffhanger up until we see her again in Mando. So this will be the continuation of what she was doing. So the leaked description series we got from Corey Van Dyke and Daniel RPK on here is the Ahsoka series description. Ahsoka Tano, played by Rosario Dawson, is on the hunt for the evil Grand Admiral Thrawn in the hope it will be her location, the missing Ezra Bridger, the young Jedi that disappeared with Thrawn many years ago. So this is what Ahsoka is going to be doing. Now I realize that this is pretty much obvious for anybody who is well aware of the Star Wars universe and has seen all of these different shows, as it's pretty obvious that Rosario Dawson's Ahsoka Tana will be looking for Ezra Bridger, rumored to be cast with Miss Mina Masood. Admiral Thrawn has not officially been cast nor has there been any leaks about the character, but Benedict Cumberbatch did say he does not want to be playing the character. Ahsoka Tano will continue her journey searching for Thrawn in this limited series. So really, this is the continuation of the Star Wars Rebels show. So Ahsoka was introduced in Rebels as, as a spy accompanying the Ghost crew on several missions, including battles with the Seventh Sister and the Fifth Brother Inquisitors, whom she handled with relative ease. But fate would lead Ahsoka to a greater confrontation with Darth Vader, now revealed to be her former master, Anakin, and now she's aware of that. They battled atop the Sith Temple, and Ahsoka delivering a strike square across his mask, seeing Anakin under it, however he was gone. They struck swords once more as the temple collapsed around them. That's where her official character description in the Star Wars databank ends. So this is going to be pretty interesting storyline to see where they officially go with this. Likely we know that she's going to be looking for Ezra, but we also know that this is supposed to intersect with Mando along the way. So whether or not Mando pa or Din Djarin, Pedro Pascal will accompany Ahsoka in one of these episodes as she did him in one of the Mandalorian episodes is yet to be seen. But this description 
fits in pretty well with what we would expect to be the Rebels spin-off show, and now that has come as well. So this plot seems pretty astute and adept to me, as this is pretty obvious, and I think that we all can agree that this is probably the actual leak description. But let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching, may God bless you, and the Force be with you always. If you enjoyed this episode, and frankly, even if you didn't, don't forget to subscribe. Do it! And if you want to help spread the word, please give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends to subscribe. Please check out the official Star Wars Coffee merchandise, and don't forget to check out all of the content playlists on this channel, including The Rise of Skywalker, The Mandalorian, and much more.